we stuck it. We actually hit the jump and stuck it. Oh, what are we doing? Where are we go? Oh, there's a full course up here. Hold on. Want to keep up with the latest Komodo gaming videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Beam and G Drive. And yes, folks, we are back once again. And today we are back with a new map. We have Crazy Land. This is by The Originators, which by the way, they have a YouTube channel if you want to check it out. I'll link it in the description. That's actually a glorious looking icon. But yeah, this is a crazy stunt map. And folks, this might be one of my new favorite maps. There's jumps, there's loops, there's off-road trails. There's about everything that you can ask for from a Beam and G map in this. I mean, look at this. We got hill climb sections here. Uh, this is the new ultimate playground. Now, not only are we checking that out, we've got a couple mods installed. I'm going to go up here. Uh, you'll notice this. This is the uh, the pre-runner truck, which I'm going to go ahead and gas it up for you guys. Hear that powerful motor. Well, we've got something else here. This is what we're going to call the Tesla of pre-runners. I think that's what Spears called it. Uh, this is a electric pre-runner. This thing is absolutely amazing. So, there's a mod for this, and it's really just a bunch of parts. You have to actually put it together yourself, uh, which is really not too hard. Uh, the first time I put it together, I realized that I believe that the drive shaft wasn't even hooked up. So, I'll show you guys real quick how to convert one of these over, uh, because it actually took me a couple minutes to figure it out fully. But, we're going to be doing that here today. If you guys are enjoying BeamNG on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button. And let's jump into this. There we go. Okay, so this is the stripped version here. Which, by the way, if you guys have any suggestions for future Beam and Gs, uh, comment below. I'm kind of curious what you want to see more of out of the Beam and G series here. Uh, do you like these kind of screw around episodes where we check out a mod, maybe check out a map? Yeah, let me know. All right, so what we're going to do here, uh, you're going to go down. You'll see that it's got a uh, six liter V8. All right, so we're going to swap that over to the rear electric motor. So give it a second. It's going to rip the motor out of the front. So we'll have a little rear electric motor, which I don't even know if it's visible. One thing you can see is that uh, the shaft here, everything's just falling out of the bottom. And that's where I was having some problems here. So you need to hook that up for one. And then next, what you're going to hook up, you can go to the rear suspension. We'll go ahead and do the little drop down. Uh, you'll see the, uh, the rear differential here. This is going to hook this back up. So go to the, uh, the electric one here. There we go. All right, so that's hooked back up. And the last thing we need to do, we need to put a battery into this thing. Uh, that way it actually can run. So if you go under fuel tank, you'll see a uh, fuel tank. You can go front battery, battery. I don't know what that means. Like you got, I guess, a front one. Maybe it weighs it down a bit. Uh, let's put a front battery into this. So here we go. Front battery. And you can see it actually installed where the engine is. So I think she's ready to run here. So let's go ahead. Give her a little bit of gas. Oh, yeah. Of course, you can't really hear it. It makes a little bit of noise, but it's not a whole lot. But that actually looks really awesome. Now, one thing about this, this thing is extremely fast. And we're about to go test that real quick. All right, let's see. You know, we should probably do a straight up jump to see who gets more air here. The uh, the gas powered one or this one? Uh, let's see, which one's the jump? I think it's going to be yeah the one that we're lined up with right now. So let's go ahead and hit this. We'll call this our starting point right here. We'll line the tires up with the front of the jump, and then we're going to give this a go here. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. All right. Question is, will I be able to go full speed down this? Oh, she's breaking traction. Oh, no. Well, I just completely, completely screwed that up. That's embarrassing. Okay. Well, she's going to tumble down. You know, the stripped down version doesn't have much to damage here, does it? It's really just uh, the chassis. You got a little body on it. Now nah, there it goes. Okay. You know, we got to watch this thing do an impact real quick. And, oh, oh, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> okay. Let's try this without failing. So obviously it's really steep. This thing likes to break traction as soon as we start going down. So I'm going to have to roll apart a bit. I'll have to fill it out. Uh, this might not be the most even test since I can't keep it wide open. Okay, so we're going to roll, roll, roll. I'm going to have to let off a little bit. This is where it breaks tra traction. And start to... Ooh, I can't ease back into it yet. Okay, ease back into the throttle. All right. Okay, she's sticking. I need like a wing or something to get some downforce here. Oh, jeez. Okay, she's actually losing speed here. Uh oh, no, 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 no. This might not be the best test uh, that I've ever conducted. Oh, no. Do we have a little bit... 
I think the ramp on this side, I believe, is a little less aggressive. We might have to go down this thing. All right, let's see if we can roll this one. I don't know. I think it's uh, not having much weight on this truck, too. Is actually killing it. Uh, yeah, because it immediately wants to turn towards the wall. And I'm not even, let, I'm not even hitting the gas yet. All right, here we go. Gas, gas, gas. Uh, and let's see. There we go. All right. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, we're going to clear it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Oh, it kind of floats. Oh, geez. Okay. And we saw about where that landed. I don't know. Maybe the other one will hook up better. Uh, I figured the electric would be plenty good, but I, th I really do think it's the weight. Uh, we should probably try this with this one. This one's got the extra attachments, the bodywork. Pretty sure the bodywork isn't that heavy, but let's go ahead and roll down. Let's see if we break less traction. Um, wide open. Okay, I'm gonna let off a little bit here. Up, oh, up, oh, no. She's still, oh, she's still really aggressive. All right, this thing has no traction going down this ramp. Uh, this test might be, oh, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's a barrel roll. Okay, we burst into flames. See, this is why it's good to have an electric one. Wait, this is the electric one. Wait, what did we blow up there? I kept thinking this was a gas one. Nope. All right. Might not be the best test in the world here. <laughs> All right, we're going off this ramp. We'll see where this one takes us. Okay, so we about start it. Yeah, we're gonna need something with a little more weight, a little more traction here. Oh, this one's steep. All right. So we got the normal gas version now. We're gonna use this one as our test. See, this feels a lot better on this side. I don't know what it does though. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, okay, apparently it lags a little bit. And then, oh, there we go. There, oh, it flips you right before you land. Wait, wait, can we stick the land? Nope, never mind. Wait, no, there's still a possibility. Landing, come on, land it. Yes, no! <laughs> oh, ooh, do we cave in the cage on the top? Oh, no. That actually felt a lot better going down that ramp. Why would that feel better in this truck? Oh, and I figured, okay, let's try this one real quick. Let's roll this one. All right, let's see, I'm wide open. Okay, let off a little bit. Man, I don't wonder if this thing's just so much lighter, it's harder to control. All right, I don't know. I would think that battery's pretty heavy, but okay, this doesn't feel too bad now. Oh, uh, will we clear the gap? We gotta clear that thing that kicked us over last time. Oh, we cleared it! Oh, we barely cleared it. You know, I, honestly, I don't think there's much difference uh, between these two going down the hill there. Hmm. Not bad, though. There's probably more tests that we can run. Uh, we'll probably run some over at the uh, uphill section and off-road stuff. But for now, I want to continue to use these ramps. So I'm going to clear all the vehicles out real quick. And I've got another ridiculous mod that I do want to check out. All right, so this thing is called the tractor. This is a part of an off-road pack that has a very, uh, very, very big selection of unique configurations. Obviously, this one being probably the most unique. Like, look at this. This is kind of, uh, this is kind of stupid, but I know somewhere here in the U.S. this has been done before, and somebody really enjoys this. <laughs> you know, more power to you. All right, let's go ahead. Let's try to ease off. Let's see if this thing will go down the ramp. Oh, no, 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 no. This is going to be okay. Okay. Uh, what kind of grip do we have? Actually, there's quite a bit of grip here. Um, what? What? Okay. This is going well. This is going really well. We are wide open right now. Why does this thing have so much grip? Oh, something's happening. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're losing it. Oh, no. Come on. Get over. Oh, <laughs> oh no. No. <laughs> Okay, I think we're good. Is there a loop at the end of this one? We need to go to that left one. There's a loop on that one. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Uh, oh, we missed it. I thought we were gonna hit the other ramp. You know, I should probably install a roll cage in this. Oh boy, oh boy. No, nope, we're good. Yeah, everything's fine. That's actually kind of cool. All right, so for our next configuration, we have the crazy diesel dragster. We're gonna go hit that uh that loop. I don't know, with the uh, the old slicks there, I don't know if this thing's gonna grip too well, but we're gonna try it out. Here we go. Drive down this. This is fine. All right. Feel the traction. No, it's pretty decent. You know, it's kind of weird that the uh, the pre-runner is the one that has the most problems getting down this. All right, here we go. We are gassed up. Oh, we are flying. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, jeez. Oh, we're a missile now. How are we supposed to get to those loops? Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh! 
Yeah, thankfully we had the water there to kind of break our fall. Hold on. Which one do we have to take to not have to deal with the jump just to get straight to... A... Wait, does that one literally just go straight vertical? I almost want to do that one. I don't know. All these uh, jumps have... Yeah, this one's got to jump here. They all have these weird kind of humps in them. So if you're going too fast, you're not going to be able to make it to the loop, I don't think. Uh, let's start here with it. And let's try to actually make one of those loops. Oh, this thing looks horrible. All right, put that back together. All right, let's see if we can actually make the loop here. Now, another thing this uh, this map has, I think there's some AI paths in it, too, uh, for some of the tracks and stuff. So maybe that's something we can use in the future. And oh, this is going to be amazing. Oh, this is going to be amazing. Oh, oh, we stuck it. We actually hit the jump and stuck it. Oh, what are we doing? Where are we go? Oh, there's a full course up here. Hold on. That looks kind of fun. <laughs> All right, we're going to do this one on the hood here. That way I can actually see what's going on. Yeah, the track actually jumps here. So, where is it? There it is. Oh, this is like a roller coaster. Oh, okay. Keep on it. Keep on it. Keep on it. Okay, here we go. Jump to this section. I need to land. Oh, there we go. Ooh, ooh. Oh, it does not want to have traction here. Okay, it's fine. It, it's fine. We're good. We're good. Wait, we are good. Wait, where are we going? Uh, is this a jump? Is this a jump? No, it's not. Oh, come on. Go straight. There we go. Uh, okay. And we're going up this side. Where does this take us? This is like a whole other little course here. Oh, no, 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 no. This thing does not want to turn. All right, there we go. Oh, there's a huge bit of uh, banking here. All right, let's go ahead and gas up. There we go. Oh, like I'm playing track mania. Oh, we almost went off. Yeah, I'm just not getting the uh, the grip here when I turn. Uh, okay, okay. No, 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 no. Okay. That looked like it hurt. <laughs> Where was that going to take us in the first place? Uh, oh, there's like a, a pit lane here. And this goes over to a... Oh, there's a Monster Jam Arena in here too? Dude, this is such a cool map. What is this? Is this like... This looks like a monster truck race. I wonder if the AI... It says it has paths. I wonder if it can make it around that. Very possible. Uh, you got an open field over here. You got trails that lead down... This leads to probably the hill climb, which I think we want to do. Uh, there's a crawler version in here of this uh, of the trucks that I'm playing with, so we might go to that. Here's another off-road trail. This thing is actually gorgeous. Look at that. That is a very, very awesome looking trail. So we got that. You have the big jumps. There's more hill climb or downhill, I guess, whichever way you look at it. Yeah, there's more of those over here. This literally is my new favorite playground uh, i like some of the other ones but i don't know this one's got really really what i was looking for especially with the off-road sections and oh yeah there's a drift track in here too yeah pretty impressive okay so what we're gonna do uh let me go ahead we're gonna reconfigure the truck we might do some more jumps here again but i do want to actually give some love to other sections of this map so uh, let's do that all right so we have the crawler version of this truck uh, we're going to try to make it up this hill. I don't know if it's going to work or not. Uh, I like to try these things, but I'm not necessarily great at them. I do want to try the Tesla truck and see if it can get up this, but we're going to try this purpose-built crawler. Now, I love to watch crawler videos. Like, there's uh, nothing like watching somebody try to get up a really steep cliff and flipping over. All right, I think that's what we're about to do here. Oh, that's a weird set of rocks. Okay, so let's go. Uh, let's just gas it up. Boom. Okay. Oh, I need some traction. Come on. Rear tires. Rear tires. No. No, you failed me. Uh oh, don't flip. No. And we are exactly what I was just talking about. Yep. We just flipped our crawler. Okay. Reset. All right. We got to figure out a way to get up this. Uh, let's see. Okay. So let's keep four wheel drive. Connect it. Is there anything that I can do here? <laughs> Is there anything that's going to help me? We can go to like a low range gearbox. Uh, would that just help me crawl up it? Okay, let's see if we can just hook to it. Uh, okay, here we go. Let's go... Uh, this... Yeah, oh, that was a bad idea. Uh, no. No. No, this is just perfect. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to bomb this hill. Like, we have to just do it with speed. Alright, let's go ahead and reset back to... Oh, about right here. Oh, there we go. That's a tree. Just got took out by a small tree. It's fine. Alright, it's time to bomb this thing. Here we go. Alright. Come on. Yeah, the way this thing's gears work. Uh, I don't know if we're getting up this. Oh! oh 
Oh no! I think we just skipped it. Uh oh, oh, and the mountain or the, the cliff is punishing us for doing that. Sorry, cliff. All right, let's try it again. All right, here we go once again. Uh, no, it's so inconsistent. All right, I think we need to get Tesla truck out here to see if it can bomb up this. I, I really do think it's going to be able to just straight up shoot up it. It's probably not going to be pretty, and it's... Oh, no, that was actually pretty ugly, too. Probably going to crash, but... Yeah, we'll see if we can get up the hill with that. All right, we are ready to go. We got the electric truck. Let's go ahead and make a run here. All right. Oh, I can feel the power. We're going to actually probably breeze over most of this, except for maybe that last part. All right, so we got to see how do we want to do this. Uh, all right, let's gas it. Uh, come on, get the traction. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. All right, we got a really, really steep part here. Come on. I don't think it's going to do it. <laughs> come on. Wait, is this thing... Oh, it's just rear wheel. I forgot about that. Oh, yeah, that might be this thing's downfall as far as and that and trees. Apparently, trees are really deadly to this. Did I just kill, like, did that go through the electric motor in the back? There's a good chance that tree just killed the electric motor. I can't really tell. All right. Wow. You know what? That is so steep. There's got to be a crawler somewhere that can actually just bomb this. Not, like, slowly get up it. Like, I want something that just speeds along up it. I'm pretty sure I might have something in my arsenal, but uh, I'm going to admit defeat on that one. Yeah, all these heels. That one looks even worse. Look at the rocks on that one. Uh, this one looks pretty bad, and then there's a big rock up at the top. Yeah, that's, uh, it's not good for me. Let's go ahead, let's head over to the freestyle, you know, let's do the race course real quick, and then we'll probably hit the freestyle course up. Alright, here we go, race course time, let's see how this thing handles it. Oh, uh, this is actually really cool. I don't know if I'm doing this in the right direction. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and say that, yeah, we are. Alright, spin it around. Come on, lose traction. I think we're supposed to stay in our lane. Yeah, if it's a uh, monster jam, I think we just stay separated. All right, so we'll go whoop and big jump. Whee! Uh oh, don't break the suspension. No, that was good. There we go. Long straight. You got another bump here. Bump here. Oh, <laughs> oh, we planted the nose. Okay, I probably should have went over that a little different. Not bad. Okay, hold on, spawn back up. Wait, where's that ramp go? Is that another? Oh, does that come off one of the big ramps? Maybe it does. Huh, let's head over to the freestyle arena real quick. Oh, man. Yeah, we definitely got to try this out maybe with some AI. All right. Uh, they've let this place go downhill a little bit, apparently. It looks like there's a lot of grass. But other than that, this is cool looking. Uh, let's go ahead. Which ramp do we want? I kind of want to hit that ramp. There's not a big lead up to it, though. Hold on. I'm going to try to swing around to that outside ramp. All right, so we'll come around. There we go. All right, here we go. Let's try to hit. Uh, I guess we're taking this ramp. <laughs> uh, I don't think this is really meant for a trophy truck. Obviously, probably monster truck is where we need to be at with this. It's still cool that this has this here. Uh, let's go ahead and hit this one. Ooh, we might end up in the grandstands. That looks so ridiculous because if you look up, you see the, uh, the ramps over there. How do you get to the... Where's the drift course at? Do I need to go out this way? No, this leads to the the garages. I swear there's a drift. Oh, there it is. Okay, found it. Uh, I don't know why I'd go on a drift course with this, but yeah, we got a drift course here. It's kind of cool, too. That is one thing I am just absolutely garbage at. I cannot drift. I mean, I'm not trying to drift here. I just spun out. But yeah, me and drifting, that's just not a thing. This has it all. Like, this is so... So great. Okay, where does this go? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I've probably not been a very good spokesperson for the, uh, the off-road vehicles and, and Tesla and all that. It's fine. Uh, let's see. What else do we have? Okay, there's a big billboard. Oh, this is the other side. The off-road. Oh, jeez. Holy man. All right, let's go down this. Uh, uh, don't flip. Don't flip. Don't flip. There we go. Oh, need some brakes. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> Oh. oh, I give up. <laughs> I don't think Komodo's doing this good anytime soon. But, nonetheless, you know, I think the one thing I did now, I did pretty good with the uh, the diesel drag and that crazy course. Uh, let's look down, see if there's anything else we can hit real quick. You know, 
I kind of want to hit that straight vertical ramp. I think I need to go, yeah, down this one. This is the last one we haven't hit. And I think we're going to wrap this up. What do you think of this map? I think it's actually uh, pretty cool. Potential to be, like, one of the new number one playgrounds for me. Uh, let's go ahead, shoot around. I guess we're going to try to take this truck down. You know, we should really take a bus down. Maybe we'll do that as the grand finale, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to, like, probably crash going down this thing. Uh, okay, here we go. Just let it ease down. We're in no hurry, because we're actually trying to make it to the end of this thing. Alright, so let's just ease down. I have no throttle in, the, in this right now. It's just naturally carrying it down that fast, okay? We'll scrub off some speed here. Uh, don't hit that. Oh, scraped it. Oh, no, I didn't realize it separated. Really? Okay. All right, folks, it's time to be a hero. Do we think we're going to actually clear this? Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at the speed. Look at the speed. Feel the power. Go over the top. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! We're going to space. Actually, we're probably going into the billboard over there. Look at that. Up, oh, and the Jados just ran out. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. This is going to be a horrible landing. Did I make it at the billboard? No, I made it over it. Oh, no, I think we're going out of the map here. Oh, this is going to hurt. Yeah, but uh, hopefully you got... Well, uh, I think we broke it. <laughs> it's normally a bad sign when it does that. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Go check out the Originators. Uh, check this map out. Uh, very cool stuff here. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Beam and G Drive. We'll be returning with some more police chases and all that other good stuff here really soon. But yeah, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.